in Temecula, California. Just letting everybody know that we've got some awesome things going on. Um, even though there's a lot of struggles going on in the world and we have to do extra things and be more vigilant, um, we made the decision after getting called by uh, the ownership here and the administration to come down and give you a high level presentation and put a program together to make sure that all the employees are safe, the management team is safe, and that all your guests are safe. And vendors too, because your vendors who are coming and delivering things, they want to have a feeling of comfort. So we put together a little program here that's real comprehensive. It basically talks about making sure that daily everyone is responsible for cleaning and then disinfecting. We have white buckets that have a high level disinfectant inside that they'll be all over the property. Everyone's responsible for pulling a couple every couple hours and just take care of your area. Because it is a village, the villagers all have to get involved. The villagers have to make sure that you're taking care of your part and then a little bit more. Being vigilant means using your eyes, using your ears, and kind of knowing your surroundings, knowing the vibe of what's happening. Our job as an outside contractor from a company called Germkill365 actually is to do high level fogging. So we actually have these industrial machines, we bring two or three techs in, it takes us three or four hours, and we completely coat the whole property. We have a once a month product that we use as a protectant that's called MicroShore that will actually has these killing spikes. As it dries, it crystallizes and makes these spikes that, that bond to the surface, so any germs that come into contact with it, it'll actually kill and dismember them. So that's a little insurance policy that you have. Once a week, we come in on those opposite weeks on Sundays, to use our regular disinfectant. The regular chemical kill disinfectants only are effective while they're wet. It'll kill everything and give you a clean slate, but it could get infected after that. That's why we have to make sure we do the, the daily cleaning. You'll see some of our crew using some of these safety precautions. That's because we don't know what kind of germs and bacteria, and it's not just COVID. There's all kinds of things in our communities. We want to make sure we protect our staff as well. So we've got gloves and masks and suits and goggles and, and booties. And um, they're highly trained and certified people that come in and, and do their job. So once a month, um, we do the 30-day protectant. And every single Sunday, we do a, a, a nice fogging of your whole place. So when everyone comes in on Monday, they know they got a nice, clean, sanitized place.